Welcome to DIY Tech. How to configure TP-Link router with Ethernet cable. Turn off your cable modem, router, and computer. Connect the WAN port of the router to the cable modem with Ethernet cable. Connect your computer to any of the LAN ports, yellow one, of TP-Link router. Power on your router and computer. Don't power on the modem before logging into the router. Power on your router and computer. Open the web browser and in the address bar type in http colon slash slash 192.168.1.1 or http colon slash slash tplinklogin.net. Then press enter. Type the username and password in the login window, both admin by default, then click login. After logging into the router, click network dash Mac clone on the left side. Click Clone MAC address to clone your PC's MAC address to one MAC address of the router. Click Save to save the settings. Click Network, one on the left of the web page. If your ISP provides static IP address for you, please select Static IP as the WAN connection type. Otherwise, please select Dynamic IP to get IP address automatically from your ISP. Static IP Enter the IP information provided by your ISP into the boxes shown as below, then click Save button. Wait about 2 minutes, if you can't connect to the internet, then power cycle the cable modem and router. Dynamic IP Click Status on the left side. Under WAN section, click Renew button. Wait about 2 minutes, then an IP address will be assigned. If it doesn't get an IP address or timeout, then power cycle the cable modem and router. Power cycle the cable modem and router. Turn the cable modem off firstly, then turn your router and computer off, and leave them off for about 2 minutes. Turn the cable modem on firstly, and wait till the modem works stable. Then turn the router on and wait about one minute, and then power on your computer. Thanks for watching.